This is how you do OMAD during the holidays. You start with prayer and you must work out. Yes, there's no bra. We're a little fluffy. Got a lot there, a lot there. But we're going to get to here. But right now we're there. But we're going to work through this. How? Windmills. Let's get some windmills in and get our chakras and energy right. Start the day thankful, appreciative, breathing, and ready. We are going to do this. A five-minute routine. Side stretches. Leg kicks. Open core. Side stretches. I had my kids at 40 and 44. I pride myself on keeping my waistline tight and right. But my behind is big and is my stomach. But we're going to get this weight off on the intermittent fasting OMAD journey and with toning, strengthening yoga and changing how we eat and when we eat. Right now, this half jacks are working our sides on our sciatic nerve area. We're going to point our foot. Get your leg up to your bed. Yeah, get it down. And stretch out that spine. Now turn your hips open. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Now you come through here. Touch that toe. Don't throw it in here. Throw it down the hallway. Woo! And roll the boat, right? I told you roll. That's five minutes. Row the boat, row the boat, row the boat. Get your hula hoop, get your hula hoop, get your hula hoop. You hear how I'm breathing? This is just five minutes to make sure your heart rate is up. Start your morning before you have your detox juice. One of Carter's Eats juicing recipes. Go through our playlist. Come on, wind up your hips. Go on. Any of them. Get the. If I had a hula hoop, I'd be moving it like that. Yeah. Go the other way. Go the other way. Go. Come on. Before Thanksgiving, before you eat. All right. Roll the boat. Ready? Come on. Just do 60. Row that boat. However, two hands, two over, two, come on. All that, all that. I want this right here. I want this pancake. I want my butt back. I don't want a pancake.
before we sit, before we eat, before you brush your teeth. Row that boat, row that boat, however you need to row it. <sighs> Got it? Do your leg kicks. <sighs> Do your leg kicks. Get them up to where your bosom is. Get, do your leg kick. Get everything loosened up, right? Do your side stretches. Do your side stretch. Make that extended. And if you want this streamline, be careful of these squats because that's only making your quads bigger. If you're watching out for that leg size, you really want to monitor that leg size, you're gonna just need to stretch. You're gonna just need to stretch. You have to. It's going away. Cause we're about to weigh in. It's a process. The house had the flu. And that's number one. We quit smoking. Two months smoke free. So we are making progress. And now with the weight loss journey. Oh mad. We're going to weigh in. We're on day nine. Allow yourself grace. It's a process. You're not going to lose 20 in a day. You're not going to lose five in a day. If at best, don't even weigh yourself. But for visual people they need to know that i'm losing right i feel it i feel the bloating i showed you the um cv will work currently i tried the um to see that video to know how the acv is helping with the omad process okay so we're breathing hard the heart rate's up <sighs> we're cleansing out some stuff if you want to see cardiovascular i'm gonna show you the wacky jacks that used to be popular back in 98 i'm gonna show you that real quick it's not a long video. We're going to get out of the way. We're going to weigh in. We're weighing in today. Day nine. Tomorrow's the big day. Ten days of OMAD. Oh, we're cooking first. I'm getting doing Blake's hair. There's the dining room table for Thanksgiving. Is it not just gorgeous? Is it not just gorgeous? You want oatmeal? You haven't had it yet? What are you saying? You don't want your hair done? Oh, okay. You can say that all day. Can't play with Marley until her hair is done. There's our bird. There she is. Miss America. I told you, and then my sister made a sweet potato pie. Mm. She said she yelled at me. Apple pie. I hope my stomach doesn't pop. <laughs> okay. A lemon pie. A mac and cheese. Look at all that goodness and layer. And then. Banana pudding. Well, we do what we gonna do. What you need to do so you're allowed to eat. Let's go way in. She knew. So you need some stuff for Blake's hair? The family said, did I take my shower? She knew. Where's the dog? Hey, Marley. She knew. And my daughter is having a hard time because she about to get her hair done. She knew. Let's go way in. Day nine. Day nine. That part right there. That part right there. Delta red couch. And that part right there. Yes! See how you begin to feel better instantly? As soon as you do what you need to do for you. Self-care. Old mad journey. Energy comes itself. I don't even feel like... Feel great. And I'll tell you on... Thursday's drive to my sister's 
had a Chick-fil-A salad at four o'clock ish because I knew I'd be on the highway and I did not want to eat any fast food. So I had a Chick-fil-A salad at my desk, grazed on that. I knew I could eat until seven. So around 6.30, we went to McDonald's, got Blake some nuggets, Papa a um, quarter pounder, Mima a fish filet, and I got a quarter pounder. I sure did. I sure did. Uh, I gave Blake like four bites, but I ate it. Uh-huh. I did. That was within the window. Within the window. So my, I knew my window was going to be four to seven because I knew I'd be on the highway. Okay, so let's do this Wacky Jacks. And let's get day nine's number. And I'm going to let y'all enjoy Thanksgiving, the holidays. But don't forget, old mad during the holidays. You can do it. The one big meal is going to be Thanksgiving. Allow yourself. Don't get too full that because you're going to fall asleep. Whenever you're on old mad, when you eat that first meal, if it's too heavy, you're going to go to sleep. So think beans. Think heavy meats, oily meats. Think vegetables. Stay away from carbs if you can. I'm not there yet. And, and you can't eat what you want. I know many people that have had their potatoes, mashed potatoes, um, french fries <clears throat> on OMAD. Me being heavier, it would do me good to stay away from potatoes. But give yourself grace. It's Thanksgiving. So um, it's the holidays, whatever. Birthday party. Just try to stick to a schedule, plan ahead, and know that if you're going to be traveling and you don't want to eat fast food, try to eat at home ahead of time and then drink a lot of water on the highway or um, just try to do it within your allotment. Give yourself three to four hours that you're allowed to eat. Don't overdo it. Let's do our Wacky Jacks and let's weigh in. Right I don't know if you can see me. If you want to keep the heart rate up and burn a couple of extra calories before you go cook, before we eat, honey, she getting snatched. Oh, she getting snatched. Day nine, wacky jacks. These are my wacky jacks. Open that chest up. Get some strength in the back. Get those thighs working. Because you don't want to do squats yet until we start to stretch this muscle out. Or you'll just have big legs, right? Let the elbows touch the hips. Let the elbows touch the hips. Squeeze your stomach. Now. Get those legs up. Get those legs up. Get those legs up. Get them up. Get them up. Get them up. Give yourself 20 of those. Do this every morning. If I don't do the wacky jack, I do jumping jacks. But I'm hitting that. And I'll show you my back step mm -hmm. on another day. But for right now, let's go weigh in. But before I do, let me show you one more thing. Now that's just my morning workout to get my heart rate up, start my day. That's not a workout. I've already showered. I've already done the three S's. That's to start my day. That's a five minute workout to make sure we're still burning calories throughout the day before we go get our juice, before we sit down to go to work. You know you've gotten your heart rate up. Try it again at lunchtime. Five minutes. We cannot live defeated. Even though we're fluffy. Even though we're 50. Even though we're 40 pounds overweight. We're going to get that heart rate up, right? So after I get like a cup of water in me, my juice, I'm going to then take my ACV. Any apple cider vinegar. This one is Umzu ACV. Get in the description box below. Get it from my Amazon store. I look a mess. I, lipstick, I'm sorry. Gray hair showing. We're going for it. Time right now. I got to tell y'all, we got to do better. We got to step it up. And I'm going to hit the mark. We going to get this weight off together. And then I'll eat around four. So I'm going to go make my sweet potato pie with Mima. We're going to go make the dressing. Drink lots of water. Hummus. Here's a little clip of what I've been eating. If I feel faint. No, you don't want to feel faint. You want to you want to do the, the healthy way. Some if, type of protein. I use hummus right here. 
Okay, so don't forget your apple cider vinegar, something to curb your appetite. And again, when I get back home, I'm going to show you the drink, one of my drinks of choice for a meal replacement. All right, let's weigh in. Let's do it. <laughs> just humor, like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna make them all fancy. Just That's just simple. Ooh. That's what he said. Put some sugar mm -hmm. and some. Oh, sugar. that was. Do or die. Open up your eyes. Head to the sky. Keep a mean bad mommy on the side. Make a tsunami. Kamikaze on the mind. Spit flow. Paparazzi flash. Shine. Get those shit.